Hey everybody, my name is Ryan. This is my Raspberry Pi Sprout. Uh, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Sprout Tutorials. Uh, today should be a really short one. We are looking at how to set up a Java environment. Uh, I've done this in some other videos, but I figured I could just uh, do a video in general for the other ones where I'm working with uh, web servers like Minecraft and Tomcat. So um, let's get into it. Today is actually really cool because they released a new version today, uh, which means I need to do some some updating on my system, but I thought it'd be a good opportunity to show you how easy it is to set up Java for your projects. So uh, I'm over here at jdk.java.net-17, uh, and .0.2 is the most recent stable one, I believe. So all we're going to do is we're going to cd to our opt folder, uh, where you can see I've got some other ones. I've got 17.0.1 and 16.0.2, uh, and I'm just going to copy this link here. I'm going to do sudo wget, press enter, and uh, you can see it's downloading there. And I'll go ahead and speed up the video uh, past this. Okay, great. Uh, so now that's downloaded. If we do ls, you'll see here's our um, most recent Java tar file, uh, and we just want to unzip it. I've got a little notepad here. Um, I'm just going to copy and paste uh, for ease. I'm going to do uh, what, like this. Um, whoa, what, what is it saying? Uh, maybe I need to run sudo here. I want to do sudo tar. No, what is what is going on here? Uh, ba -da -ba -da Linux arch. Oh, right. OK, sorry. Dumb. Uh, we want to do sudo tar minus cxvf. And I have to type out this whole thing. Uh, this one here. Okay, I think that should work. Cool. Now we're getting a bunch of stuff. It's opening up. Okay. And my toilet is singing, so you can probably hear that in the background. Okay, there it is. It's gone. Uh, right, where are we? So now we should have, there it is, uh, JDK 17.0.2. Uh, next, what we want to do is uh, update our... Um, our alternative Java uh, environments, uh, so our computer recognizes them. And now we can configure Java uh, by doing this command here. Uh, so uh, what we see here is a bunch of different Java versions. Here's the one I'm currently running on, JDK 17.0.1. Uh, and this is the new one, which is pretty awesome. I need to, again, update my system to uh, a couple of things on my system to point to this directory. Uh, but that's how you set up Java. If you ever want to switch, you can just run this command here. Uh, and for example, if I wanted to switch to number three, I press three and type enter, but I'm not going to do that. Uh, I'll do that at a different time. So I'll just press enter to stay where I am. And again, we'll just check where we are by doing Java dash version. Uh, and there we are. You can always check where you are with Java dash version. Uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching and um, take care. I'll see you in the next video.